Next speaker is uh, John Quarterman from Wales. <laughs> Can you point this out? Uh, yeah, that's Walls, W-W-A-L-S, Walls, Walls Doctrine Coalition. Yes, that's correct. Uh, with the Coochie, Willie Coochie, Alapaha, Little, and Sawani River Systems practice, and you can say it one breath, too. Uh, I'd like to thank you all for passing that amendment uh, or recommendation regarding the Hamilton County Comprehensive Plan change. Uh, uh, I'm the Swanee River Keeper, so I'm particularly concerned about the Swanee and all the other rivers in the basin. And our parent organization, Walls Watershed Coalition, was formed in 2012 largely because of Valdosta sewage issues. And you may not be aware of what's really the underlying cause of that, and it has to do with too much impervious surface, too many parking lots, too many roads, too much clear cutting and too little planning about where that water is going to go. So that development in Hamilton County, for example, well, downtown Valdosta is three miles from the Withacoochee River. That development is three miles from the Sawani River. So it's good to have some water planning. Now magnify that by 100, 1,000, I don't know, for this Suncoast connector. Do we really want something like that barreling through the Sawani River Basin with this one sentence? as to where it's going to go, and nothing about any planning for water retention. Seems like a bad idea. You may have seen my uh, op-ed in the Gainesville Sun, it's online, it should be in the paper, paper Sunday. The high points are 54 million a year just to study this thing. For that amount of money, you could do water quality testing on every river in the state, I bet, for sewage and nitrates. And um, if you really want economic development in rural counties, I, I would strongly recommend solar power instead. It brings local construction planning jobs. It reduces bills. So that's basically what I came here to say. I can talk longer if you like. I'm up one minute. Oh, yes. Since I have a little more time, I'd like to invite you to come. <laughs> and join 300 of our closest friends on Paddle Georgia, which is going to paddle from Georgia into Florida in the middle of June. And if you don't want to do the whole seven days on the rivers, you can do one day. That's uh, June 17th. It's professional day. Elected officials get in free. Everybody else is 30 bucks. I have some other things that I'll invite you to, but uh, that's the one that's coming up most quite quickly. Thank you. Next speaker is Eileen Cox. Hello, I'm from Swanee County, and I'm the one flying.